In a statement, Datuk Sri Abdul Rahman said that job creation since 2010 was broad-based but strongest in the services sector which created 1.78 million jobs during the period. He said this was in line with the services sector being the biggest contributor to Malaysia's economy with its share of contribution to GDP at 54%. With strong job creation, he said the government was able to maintain the full employment level in the labour force, with unemployment kept at a low rate of 3% to 3.5%. He attributed the achievement to the Economic Transformation Programme, ETP, envisioned by Prime Minister Datuk Sri Mohamad Najib Tun Raza, saying that the government has been implementing various initiatives to address graduate and youth unemployment issues. He added that the Barisan National Government will continue to provide solutions and look at all possibilities to ensure more people are employed. And at the same time, the government will make sure that it delivers world-class talent. Datuk Sri Abdul Rahman said that since 2011, the government has introduced Skim Latihan Satu Malaysia Slim, which has helped 130,000 graduates improve their marketability in the job market, with 90% of them securing jobs. He said that Talent Corp had training programs and schemes to transform graduates into highly employable executives for the service industry and equip them with industry-relevant skills. The minister noted that there are ample grant programs, research and commercialization funds funds and cradle investment funds for new businesses to choose from and that there are also special funds for Malaysian youths starting their own businesses. He gave the example of the Young Entrepreneur Fund through the SME Bank which offers low interest rates for financing of up to 100,000 ringgit while the Graduate Entrepreneur Fund was a soft loan scheme aimed at graduates.